third stop in the Wiesman World Cup men's bobsleigh two-man competition moves to the Olympic track in Park City, Utah. Here is Lyndon Rush, Neville Wright of Canada, fifth place at the end of the first run. Watch what happens here. Unbelievable pictures. Rush crashes, comes back on his runners, finishes with the ninth best time of the run. Next up, Carl Onger and Christian Friedrich. Now, I say Christian Friedrich, this is important. Carl Onger comes down, fourth place here to the first run. He posts the best time of the heat. He's in first place with three sleds to go. Next up, United States, Steve Holcomb, Kurt Tomasevich, third place here to the first run. But Holcomb struggles at the top of the track, hamstring problem maybe, posts the 13th best start time and cannot match anybody's time at the bottom. Post the seventh best time of the run, he falls back four places. So now Angerer is in a medal, he thinks. Simon Bertazzo of Italy, second place here to the first run. Bertazzo disappointing in Whistler and Calgary to start the season, but on this night, he posts the fastest time of the second run, and the Italian coaches celebrate. They've guaranteed themselves at least a silver medal. Angerer still thinks he's in third. Now, Alexander Zukov of Russia. He blew the field away in the first run. Second run made a few driving errors, but the first run lead made it impossible for anybody to catch him. He goes away, wins the gold medal. Bertazzo of Italy wins the silver, and Manuel Machado moves up to third because Unger is disqualified. Zubkov wins the event. Machado takes over the World Cup lead. Strange night here in Park City.